You are watching With a Cup of Tea, a production of This House of Books, an independent bookstore cooperative and tea shop in downtown Billings. Now, here's our show. Can you present yourself? Uh, my name's Sam Leitner. I'm a writer from Lander, Wyoming, and uh, I'm up visiting Billings uh, uh, to promote my latest book, uh, Heavy Green. And what is special about this book? Because you have uh, eight books before, and uh, it's different. Yeah. Uh, well, this book is uh, historical fiction. Uh, I've, I've, I've written it um, with the fiction part being merely the characters. Everything else that takes place in the book is real. Uh, uh, the people are not real people, but the events that take place in it, all of the history, um, every little facet of it is factual. And uh, I, I tell people, all right, you're not going to learn about a person, but you're going to learn about the events that are in this book, and it's going to be historically accurate for you. Okay, and what is events exactly? Maybe? Essentially what it, the book is about is in uh, uh, 1967 to deal with the uh, movement of weapons from northern Vietnam to south Vietnam on the Ho Chi Minh Trail. Uh, the United States was bombing the supply network. And to try and stop the flow of the weapons, we put an air traffic control center on top of a mountain. And that control center was not to direct planes landing, but to direct them on bombing runs. And those bombing runs were literally only 135 miles from Hanoi, the North Vietnamese capital. So the North Vietnamese realized right away they had to get rid of the facility and we realized it was very effective, we needed to keep it, and neither side was supposed to be in Laos, so it was all a big top secret event, uh, yet this big battle took place that no one even found out about until uh, 1988 when it was declassified. And part of the reason why I write about what the war is about is um, people born, say, 1965 and later, our history classes don't include uh, the Second Indochina War. They don't include the Vietnam War. Um, we learn about that from movies and things like uh, you know, pop culture because it's a taboo subject. You just don't go into it uh, in school. So I was going to write something that would be entertaining and uh, would also you know, explain the war and be accurate in its explanation. Oh, wonderful. And uh, who is your audience? My audience would be travelers. Uh, would be one group, but definitely history buffs. However, this book is a ticking clock, so to speak. You know, you 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 read uh, um, a Clancy novel or you know any novel that is a, a thriller fiction novel. There's a ticking clock going on. They've got to get something done uh, before blank happens. Okay. Well, in this book, that the same thing's going on. It's just blank was a real event. So there's a ticking clock happening. All of this stuff has to happen, and something's going to happen on a given day. How are we going to get it all done by then? It's going to be difficult to do. You, you've got that clock. You've got that angst all the time in it. So it, it almost reads like a thriller fiction novel. OK. And uh, uh, you said that you never thought that you are a writer. How mm. everything started? <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I never thought I would be a writer. Um, 30 years ago, I took a trip to Thailand. Um, <clears throat> I went over there uh, to look for rocks for rock climbing and uh, expected it was going to be a very difficult trip and I wound up having such an amazing trip that I got on the airplane to fly home with a pad of paper and a pen and I wrote my first magazine article and uh, uh, the magazine published it the next year and said hey we'll, we'll do more of this if you travel to any more places like that so I did four or five more countries and wound up with a resume and never expected I was going to be a writer, but that's how it happened. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Thank you. This has been a production of This House of Books. If you'd like to be a part of the cooperative, please visit thishouseofbooks.com slash get involved.